So you're probably wondering, how can I make time for myself and my health with this forever long to-do list and so many people counting on me and my family and business? Well, I'm gonna tell you why this outdated thought process is actually keeping you as a stuck casual implementer and how to shift your thinking so you become an adaptive business leader on your path to freedom and fitness. Hey, I'm Reggie Wilson, guilt-free weight loss coach and founder of Fit for Freelance. Like, comment, and subscribe for compassionate health coaching on your path to freedom and fitness. And hit the bell to be notified when I drop new videos on Tuesdays. So as a health coach, I've heard plenty of stories of how people feel like they don't have time to take care of themselves and their health when they have so many other responsibilities and a to-do list. Sometimes I even feel like it's a burden on others for them to take care of themselves. Now, this is kind of a normal feeling, but I want to point out that these people don't just need you, um, they need you to be your best. Comment below and tell me who's someone that deserves you showing up as your best self. So the thing is being dehydrated, not eating well, and inactivity all sap your energy. Have you considered how less effective and less present you are for these other important things when you don't have these fundamentals in place correctly. The biggest thing is most people don't consider by just continuing to exist and live, you're making choices every day regarding these health habits. So if you aren't choosing your meals, you're probably picking some less healthy foods, maybe you're hitting a drive through more often, you're getting takeout, you're getting things that don't necessarily support your health and might even be encouraging you to gain weight. Similarly, if you're sitting at your desk eight hours, 12 hours a day, staying crunched up, and then you go and you sit on the couch and watch Netflix for the rest of the day, and you're not getting active, that's a health choice that's gonna affect your weight gain and your energy on how you show up for these other important tasks. But the key is your body needs great nutrients and circulation. It depends on movement for it to be effective. If you keep deprioritizing healthy choices, you're going to gain weight, you're going to increase your risk of chronic disease, you're not gonna have energy to do the things that you want to do. Most importantly, it affects how you show up for these people and things that you care most about. So if you want to be an adaptive business leader to start making healthier choices and show up your best for the people you care about, then check out my free game plan, Four Minutes to Start Losing Weight. The link's in the description below. Also, if you want to hang out with me, I'm on Instagram at Fit for Freelance, where I share tips to become an adaptive business leader through compassionate health coaching. I'll put a link below for that as well. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up and then check out one of my other videos on your path to freedom and fitness.